Hey guys, so I'm gonna show you a real quick technique. I don't have a darning needle on my sewing machine, so I can't do the free motion stitching. Um, I just have a real simple, literally a simple, Singer Simple uh, sewing machine. So in order to do that free mo motion stitching, I found out a trick from the lady at Joanne and this woman is fantastic because she totally saved me like $20 for that darning uh, foot. So I'm gonna switch over to the sewing machine and show you how you can do free motion stitching on your sewing machine even if you don't have the uh, darning foot or the quilting foot. So uh, let's head over and take a look, shall we? Here we go. Hi. So. I know I mangled at the sewing machine so you can see. But essentially what the lady told me is that if you don't have that that needle or that uh, foot, you just remove the foot that you currently have on. So I just have the generic presser foot on my machine. And then uh, make sure you lower it back down. But there's still enough room to slide whatever you want under there. And then it should give you the ability to do some free motion stitching. So let's see if this works, shall we? Otherwise I'm gonna mess up this butterfly hardcore. All right, so I would consider that a win um, my only recommendation would be to make sure you keep tension on the paper uh, because there's nothing there pushing the paper down between the presser dogs or the feeder dogs and the presser foot. So, um, but I did get a really cool little effect on the sides of my butterfly wings. Obviously the bottoms are kind of messed up. Let's see. Bottoms are a little messed up, but that's okay. No big deal. You know I don't care about imperfections. So um, it just gave a really cool little design. So, But this would work really well on an art journal page uh, if you don't have the darning needle because the paper is bigger so it would there'd be more for you to stabilize it. Um, this is just a piece of lightweight uh, cardstock essentially. So it, uh, yeah, so watercolor paper or even just normal size art journal page, just keep the tension on it, it should be good.